Hey, it's Andrew from Park Rovers, and we are here at Walt Disney World at Disney's Old Key West Resort. Let's check out a one-bedroom villa. So we are going to look at room 5615 here at Disney's Old Key West. And right when you walk in, you have your vacuum, your mop, and a sweeper in this closet here. You can see the evacuation route posted on the right. And this is the entryway. I like that you have a mirror and a shelf here. And this is a connecting door. This could be a two bedroom lock off with a studio attached. So this is how you would get to the studio, but we just have the one bedroom for this video. So if you go left here, that is the living room. And if you go right, that leads to the bedroom. So we're gonna go to the bedroom first and then we'll come back to the living room. As you walk to the bedroom, you can see you have a map here of Florida reefs from Newfound Harbor Key to Boca Grande Key. And if you take a right, this leads to the laundry room. And on the right, you have a washer and dryer. You have laundry detergent right on the washer and a laundry basket up above. And on the wall on the left, you have your iron, ironing board and more cleaning supplies hanging on the wall here. So you got a broom there. Walking through the laundry room and into the primary bathroom now, you have the toilet on the left here. You have a corner shower and you have a mirror and a sink. Walking into the shower now, let's check this out. You have a nice handheld as well as a shower head up above. And on the right here, you have a cutout in the wall for uh, anything you brought. <laughs> and uh, you also have the, the body wash shampoo and conditioner pumps on the wall. Here is the sink. You also have a nice mirror up above. Here's the bath soap and the H2O plus body lotion. Very nice. And under the sink, you have plenty of storage space here. And you have a hair dryer, extra Kleenex, and, uh, and toilet paper down below. Now let's check out the other side of the primary bathroom. And here's where you'll find the jacuzzi tub and another sink. So you have another sink here with an additional bath soap and body lotion and a nice mirror up above. You also have a mirror on the back of the, the door leading to the other half of the bathroom. One thing I want to point out, there is no extra hair dryer. So if you need to use the hair dryer, then you got to go into the other side of the bathroom. There's a closet in this side of the bathroom with some extra pillows and blankets some hangers, and this is where you'll find your safe. So if you need to store any valuables, you can do that right here in this closet. Cool. Now let's check out the primary bedroom. So just for wayfinding, we just went down that hallway in the laundry room and basically just did a loop around and if you go straight, you can go straight into the primary bedroom. Got uh, some nice artwork here on the wall. Very spacious primary bedroom. So this bedroom is a very nice. It has this uh, chair here and nightstands on both sides of the bed, as well as this mirror and bench right over here, which is very convenient to uh, put on your shoes, maybe put your luggage on top of that The bench here. Nothing in these drawers, but plenty of storage space in this room. Got a 
decent sized TV with some receptacles. You have USB and regular power plugs, actually two sets of uh, two plugs and two USBs, and then plenty of drawers below the TV. So that is the primary bedroom. One additional thing I want to point out is you do have an access door to the patio. We are on the, the first floor. You have four chairs out here as well as a table. So you do have kind of your own nice semi-private. You can see other rooms in building 56 here. But semi-private, you also have access to the patio from the living room, which is what we're going to check out next. So we're back in the entryway now. So we went right to check out the laundry room, the primary bathroom, and the primary bedroom. Now we're going left. And this is the living room. Very nice and spacious here. And the first thing I see is this chair here. This is actually a pulled out bed. So you can actually fold out this chair and I think it pulls out into a, a single, a, a twin size bed. Very nice. Got some artwork on the walls here. Also in this room is a full size couch and a love seat. And right now we are still celebrating Disney's 100 years, so you get to look at one of these books for the story of Disney's 100 years of wonder, 100 years celebrating the birth of the Disney company. In the corner of the living room, you have your phone, you have your take-along guide to the magic, and you have your Hey Disney Echo device, which is, by the way, off by default, so it's not listening to you. I really like this lifeguard chair here. This is really cool. See the hidden Mickey at the top of the chair there. Very nice. And a very nice TV. You have a dining table with four chairs. Here's the access to the, to the patio. Very nice. Kind of have this bar area over here. This is cool. And shelf up above and storage space, it looks like. Yep. A storage space down below. Very cool. And now let's check out the kitchen. So here is the kitchen. You have a whirlpool refrigerator, a whirlpool stove, microwave, and a dishwasher. So let's check out the refrigerator. We're going to pop on the ice maker. Those aren't on by default when you check in. So you, if you want ice, you should turn that on. And of course, we have nothing in the fridge yet. And let's go through the cabinets. Nothing above the fridge. But we're going to go through and see what's inside all of these. Right next to the microwave, no, just storage space. And nothing above the microwave. Can I have this area here with your strainer? You have a bowl, your measuring cup, and some baking and storage accessories here. And of course, here are your, here are your plates, your serving dishes, your bowls, casserole dish lots of plates and you have your full amenities guide right on the back of this cabinet door. So here is everything that should be in your unit. I have some wine glasses, drinking glasses, coffee cups, and a couple of juice cups there on the side. Wow, a cheese grater uh, and a little pitcher here, another few different bowls here. And, and just storage space. So now let's go through the counter and then we'll go through, through the drawers down below. So here is the stove top. You have a four slice toaster. You have your Mr. Coffee with 
plenty of coffee here. Some dark roast, some decaf. Interesting, there's no tea. I'm sure you can request that. And here is the sink. Now let's check out the drawers below. To the left side of the stove, you have some cooking utensils and oh, a baking dish and a cutting board. And let's see, under the stove, yep. And, oh, here's, here's your silverware, can opener, measuring cup, or sorry, <laughs> measuring spoons, and uh, your wine opener. Let's see a whisk back there. And here is your pots and pans. And then you have your Whirlpool dishwasher. And under the sink, oh, you got a lot of stuff under here. You have uh, your you have your paper towels, extra paper towels, and your trash and recycling. And one last look here. Oh, just some storage space here. So that's all the drawers and cabinets in the kitchen. And on the back side here, just some storage space here on the back side of the TV. So that's a look inside a one bedroom here at Disney's Old Key West Resort. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to Park Rovers, and we'll see you next time.